Mr. President, the presence of positive role models is crucial in crime prevention as it provides young people with alternative narratives and aspirations beyond what they might encounter in their immediate environment. In this regard, I am honored to introduce to the General Assembly two distinguished Olympic champions that are today with us and sitting at Italy's desk. Valentina Vezzali, a foil fencer, has won six Olympic gold medals and is a 16-time world champion. She's one of only five athletes in the history of a Summer Olympics to win five medals in the same event. And Antonio Fantin, a swimmer, has won six gold medals at the Paralympic Games and the World Championships. In 2022, he was awarded the International Sports Prize for World Athlete of the Year. So, Valentina and uh, Antonio, thanks for being with us today. Both are esteemed members of Fiamme Oro, the police sports team. The Ministry of Interior is firmly convinced that sport can be an effective tool for crime prevention and, jointly with the Ministries of Justice and Sports, has promoted sport programs for young people, such as gyms of legality, to engage them in sports and educational activities and foster a culture of legality and social cohesion in degraded areas. In conclusion, Mr. President, Italy remains dedicated to leveraging the power of sport to prevent crime and build peaceful and inclusive communities. I thank you. I think the distinguished ambassador of Italy